There's been talk again in the transfer window of interest in you, I think, an approach from a team in England. How do you view your situation at the moment and your time at Rangers? The situation is that I'm focused only on Rangers, like I always said when it's talking about transfer. I'm focused only on Rangers, that uh, was the most important. Uh, I'm not reading newspapers and things like that, but uh, I heard a lot of how I want to, to say wrong information. Uh, not all of them, but uh, a lot of wrong information. So all the answers on my uh, situation uh, you will have at the start of February. So that's my answer. You expect to still be a Rangers player at the start of February then? You never know in football. You know how it goes. Uh, what if someone come and said 30 million for Borna? I will not be here, right? So I cannot say you uh, right answer and maybe then you will say that I lie at the end. But uh, only what's the what's matter is that uh, I'm fully professional, like always. I'm fully focused on Rangers, uh, on our next game, which is Aberdeen. And all the answers, as I said, you will have at the start of February. The, um, <clears throat> Stephen Gerrard used the two international breaks that earlier this season, he said, to reset the team. You've had a longer break this time under the new manager with uh, Giovanni. Has he been um, using that to look at more dramatic um, tactical changes? And does, has that impacted on what you're going to be doing in defence? Uh, yes, we work, of course. We had uh, now the last 10 days chance to work on some tactic things. But uh, I cannot say that we did. And... Uh, something what you already didn't see uh, this season we just uh, do some small changes some small things you know and of course uh, i think that <coughs> we used very good these last 10 days or two weeks how long it was uh, to prepare ourselves for the next half of the season and that's it hi Borna. Um, the manager seems to have changed your role slightly since he came into the club can you outline the demands that he's put on you and how much uh, you're enjoying the, the slightly altered role? Yes, you can see that, that uh, fullbacks don't have the uh, same, uh, same things to do like we did with uh, Steven Gerrard. But uh, it's uh, on our manager how he wants to play, how he wants to have a position in a, at the game, on the pitch, you know. And I'm happy uh, with that. Uh, it's just part of the tactic. Uh, every game is uh, other tactic. It's not always the same, you know. Uh, also for me, sometimes I can go much more up and down, sometimes no. But uh, it also depends, as I said, um, uh, on the on the on against who we play. And of course, whatever I need to do, I will do just to win the game. The, the team have started really aggressively in, in some recent uh, games away from home, Hearts and, and Livingston in particular. Is that something that the managers relayed of great importance to not allow the home team to, to settle into the game? Yes, that is one of the things, one of the things. But uh, since our new manager came, there is a lot of new things. You can see that in our uh, style of play, you know, and uh, in our tactic also. So it's... Uh, there is a lot of differences, you can uh, see that and uh, I think that we, uh, since he came here, as our results show actually that we did very well, that it's sweet to us, you know, uh, everyone like uh, are 100 percent at training, everyone knows what they need to do in every moment, so I can say that uh, everything is very nice now. Since uh, you, uh, the manager came in, Calvin Bassey has been playing at, at centre-back. As the more experienced player, do you feel a responsibility to Calvin to help guide him through games in what is an unusual position for him? Yes, I agree with you. I feel that responsibility. He's younger, uh, his natural position. He can play that, as you can see, but obviously he played uh, left-back. So, of course, that I uh, using my experience to show him some things, some, uh, uh, some things where he can improve. But also, I want to say that he played very well. And I'm very pleased and very happy because of him. He's a young guy, young boy who always want to learn every day, always want to listen, experience uh, player. 
players. So it's very nice uh, to play with him and I think that our clean sheets uh, showed how we played uh, our defense, not only back four, I think all team. The improvement in the, the stats since Giovanni Van Bronckhorst came in for the back four has been incredible. I think it's something like only two goals conceded since he arrived in. Um, has that been maybe getting to play more as a unit? Because there was a lot of injuries earlier in the season, whereas there's been a wee bit more stability in the selection. Yes, one of the things are probably injuries. You know, when you are up down with the player, someone is injured one game, then he played and things like that. Uh, it's hard to stabilize back four or team. But I think that we did that, that now. We stabilize ourselves, our team, our defense, you know. And of course, uh, it helps It helps a lot to keep clean sheet and to consider less goals. Oh, now you said earlier that some of the things written about you or reported about you were accurate, other things were inaccurate. Can you tell us if there's been any genuine interest in you in this transfer window? It was, yes. It was been. But I said I don't want to go in details now. I just said that there is a lot of rumors. I mean, that's normal thing in one way. But I just want to say to, 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 to the people that there is, of course, always some wrong information. And uh, as I said to you, all the answer about transfers, about me, uh, you will have at the beginning of February, right? How did you react to that interest? How did I react? <laughs> when you learned there was interest in you? I said before that I don't want to go to details. Okay, so it doesn't matter now anything. The most important thing, as I said, is uh, Rangers. I'm 29 years old, I'm uh, very experienced. Uh, I know what is, uh, I know what is uh, this badge. Uh, so you need always to be 100% and on the training, at the pitch, without that, it, it's impossible to play here, you know. So I really, I'm really focused on Rangers and that's, uh, that's the only thing what is matter now. And the, all the answers, once more time, will be here, start of the February, right?